Hello everybody, it's Dot Vesu from New Edubox and welcome to your very first HTML5 tutorial guys. So thanks guys for visiting my channel, thanks for uh, showing the interest in the tutorials and uh, guys for those of you who have been following my tu um, past tutorials on HTML, you are already uh, familiar with the uh, main text, main, uh, uh, the software that we use and uh, how the structure of the websites are built. But again, if you are uh, totally new to my to my courses, uh, guys, I'm gonna show you how to do it from uh, point A. So, the first thing uh, for us uh, to start, uh, guys, you will need a simple program uh, program that is called Notepad++. So let's just go ahead and uh, download it right now, and I will show you how to do it and where to find find it. Open up the Google and type it in uh, Notepad++. You will get the info right away, and uh, where you see the down download uh, link, just click on it, and you will be re redirected to a Notepad++ website where you can simply download this. So, guys, uh, download the installer, install it on your computer, and uh, uh, if you're new to this course, uh, come back once you're done, and we, uh, we will be able to carry on. So that's uh, the pop-up that you should get. Okay, I'm gonna cancel guys and come back to the video once you're ready. Okay guys, I hope you have installed the Notepad++ and we can start it off uh, with the uh, HTML5 course right now. So guys, uh, as you remember in my last tutorial uh, covering uh, HTML401, I was giving you a short introduction to different three doc types that are used in uh, HTML401. And those uh, three different doc types were transi transitional, frame set, and the strict one. Now HTML5 has evolved a little bit, and uh, W3 Consortium has made some changes. And uh, HTML5 has only one doc type, which is very very simple. You get the, uh, these brackets. I don't know what they are called. You type it in the exclamation mark doc type in HTML. That's everything you need. You don't need any long lines describing the doc type nor telling the type of the HTML doc type that, that you want to use. And on my screen, guys, you can uh, now see the minimum uh, mandatory uh, tags that you have to enter in, into your HTML document or otherwise a Notepad++ in order for your document to be recognized as the HTML file. So go ahead and do that. You can see that I have HTML tag, uh, head tag, title tag. Uh, title will be uh, on the top of the web page and the body tag. So these few tags are mandatory ones uh, uh, for you to enter in order for your HTML document to be uh, well formed and uh, to keep simple, good housekeeping rules. Okay guys, now a couple of things that I want to introduce you uh, to uh, during this uh, very first tutorial are the uh, little bit of a history and what's the HTML5 is how HTML5 is different from HTML401. So guys, uh, know one thing that uh, uh, HTML5 is basically advanced and upgraded version of HTML 401. HTML 5 has a uh, little bit different, um, let's say, functionality, which is uh, basically giving you and your user a little bit uh, nicer way of uh, um, build your website. And uh, those, uh, uh, let's say, new features that HTML 5 uh, has uh, includes uh, uh, well, new elements, new attributes, uh, full CSS3 support. Uh, you can uh, include some graphics. You can uh, uh, create your, the local storage for uh, on your website. Uh, then uh, one more thing is uh, mul multimedia uh, tags are included, like video and audio, and you can embed them in your HTML document, and quite a few other uh, well add-on. For HTML5 that are, that make this language a little bit more attractive for website building. Okay, guys. Uh, now, 
first of all, let's see, let's uh, let's put it uh, for the beginning that uh, initial text for our I'm using the heading text in order for you to see how would it look like. This is the first HTML5 tutorial. Great. And I wanted to enter the exclamation mark. Okay, guys. And uh, for those of you who are first time watchers of the video, if I may call you so, uh, you can run the, this bit of a code on your uh, on whatever the browser you are using. I'm us using Firefox, so I'm just gonna refresh the document on on red HTML file. So this is it guys, you can see that uh, require tag uh, as a title we got the HTML5 video tutorials and uh, we get on the screen uh, this is the first HTML5 tutorial printout. So this is basically guys the first uh, lesson that I wanted to cover uh, for you and uh, introduced you shortly to HTML5. Uh, in the next video, I'm gonna go already through very uh, uh, simple and uh, basic stuff that you have to know in order to start building websites with HTML5. So, guys, uh, thanks uh, for you, to, you know, for sticking with me for this sh very short intro video uh, to HTML5. Uh, make sure to hit the subscribe button. Make sure to hit the like button if you like the video, and I will see you in the next uh, lesson.